good team exclusive and welcome back to some more FIFA 21 Road to Glory content. Today we are back with another episode of the Road to Glory. Now, um, first things first, um, hopefully everyone's doing well and obviously staying safe uh, in whatever part of the world you are. And uh, second thing is, um, yeah, there was no upload yesterday just because it was... Uh, uh, it was just uh, shut up the entire day, pretty much. Everything, everything that you could imagine went wrong, went wrong. So, yeah, it wasn't uh, wasn't the greatest day. But we're back today, and uh, I've been doing a, a little bit of grinding in the background, not um, not kind of keeping up to my schedule that I really wanted to. Um, that I mentioned in the team of the year preparation video, but yeah, so it's kind of uh, <laughs> kind of shut the bed a little bit. But I did complete the headliners mystery ball challenge for obviously this uh, this prime gold players pack nothing too exciting um you know the pack itself you know you never know you could get something quite good out of it but uh, it's nothing too overly incredible and obviously you only have to win four uh, score six and assist eight so um very easy stuff and also i want to say i really hope they do more of these kind of challenges because it was really good fun um you know obviously mystery ball kind of takes the whole seriousness out, uh, away from the game um because it gives you like a speed boost and then you've got like 200% speed so it's, it's it's literally insane but it was actually really good fun um and uh yeah i really enjoyed it so it was actually uh, very very easy and for once they didn't put a they didn't put a cap on how many games you could actually play to get it so uh good job from ea i guess we're still still slowly working working our way towards this not that again it's not something i really care about so it's not something i really desperately need um it's something i could do towards the end of the season we've still got still got a whole month left of this season uh 30 days so you know it's not you know not too much for of a struggle if i'm if i'm in desperate need of the xp we'll probably consider doing it but um as you can see we also reached level 15 on the road to glory and the choice the choice of three players three the, so the choice we've got is which one is which one is the, the most less shit? Oh, I have to. Why not? Screw it. I mean, if we build a Serie A team, I suppose he can go in there if, when we pack um, Team of the Year Cristiano Ronaldo. He'll go a bit right in there. But uh, yeah, he actually looks quite good, to be fair. Okay, 99 shot pound, 93 long shots. Oof, okay. I mean, obviously, he's got good pace. He's got really good passing. Dribbling's okay. Uh, defending and physical is actually very nice. So, um, so his in-game stats... Don't really reflect his face card stats. They're actually a lot better than what his card would would suggest for an 83. Um, very good looking card. Bit shame. Bit of a shame. He's he's pretty hard to link. So um, I will take that. I will take that. And of course, there is our 84 plus player pick just sitting there. Oh, it's getting it's getting it's getting hard. I'm going to be honest. It's getting hard not to uh, not to open those. But um, we'll fight the urge. We'll fight the urge and we'll get there. Hopefully, it will reward us. Give us a team of the year. Can you imagine? Team of the year out of the 84 plus player pick after I've saved up all of these packs. Just be our luck. But um, I've been changing. Well, I haven't changed up the team. I've changed the formation. Because I, I felt like I've been struggling with just one CDM. That's why I felt like I've been conceding a lot of goals and, and all that kind of stuff. So we're going to try this out. See how it plays. Um... Uh, it's difficult because, you know, um, I could obviously go with lots of really meta players that would probably be a lot better. Um, I don't know, like Vardy, Gabriel Jesus, that kind of stuff. Um, but I've gone with Maradona and obviously Messi. They're not the strongest, so they get pushed off the ball really easy. And it's just um, it's difficult to kind of have any hold up play. But we grinded and we worked towards getting uh, Gravenberch. From the Eredivisie, he looks like a very, very good looking card as well. Very similar to Duncan, actually. Um, just maybe not with the whole defensive prowess, but he, he's got a very good looking card as well. Yeah, looking forward to trying him. Uh, not, not really too impressed with Robin. He's one of those kind of cards that's... He looks good on the face of it, but in-game he, he doesn't play anywhere near as, as good as I think his, uh, his card suggests. He, I think we've all kind of experienced this. If you've got Robin, he runs really weird. So... Yeah, I'm not sure what's up with that. He doesn't feel like he's got 93 pace. He gets caught very, very easy. Um, so, yeah, 
There's that. But uh, that's the, how the team's going to look. Let's jump into the first game. And also, they finally changed the kit. I don't know how long it took them to do that, but finally they've changed... Finally, they've changed the e -La Liga kit, so it's not just a white kit. Anyway, first team today... <clears throat> excuse me, you don't often see Robert up top. Um, it's a good, it's a good looking team, to be fair. It's a good looking team. Ash, shut up the defending there already. Brilliant, Messi. Yeah. I just couldn't couldn't get him to take the shot quick enough, really. But that was a good, another good save by by Manuel. More things, uh, more things you love to see. Great tackle by Opara. Come on, Messi. There we go. Let's go, Leo Messi. <clears throat> Back at it again. Uh, like. Messi is just so good, I, I swear. It's such a good... Um, I, like, I'm so happy we've, we've, we got that card. Not that we had much choice in it, but I'm, you know... The, the, the problem I've got is Messi never really... He doesn't play that well because um, he's really short, but... Well, para. That's not good. Well, I'm very lucky that, to be fair. Um, yeah, he's so short and just so weak that he doesn't really play that well. Ah, damn. Oh, Maradona's kept it. Let's go. Not ideally the pass I wanted to make, but we take it. Rasko with the skills. Oh, Kappa, <laughs> please. Wait, Kappa. Oh, yeah. what? What was I saying? Yeah, like, Messi's always been this really short, like, weak player. And especially in FIFA 21, he doesn't really play all that well. Wait, hold up. Messi from there. Um, yeah, so it's just like, it's so easy to push him off the ball, but he is just, he is so good. And he, that was poor, that was, to be fair. That was really poor. Um, yeah, so he, he never plays all that well, but like, uh, I don't know. When you can get him in shooting opportunities, he just, he just doesn't miss. Go on, Maradona. There we go. Getting in those skill moves with Robin. Jeez. You'd love to see it. Oh, Messi again. Dropping the shoulder. Raven Birch. Let's go. Getting his first goal on his debut rivals game for us. Another more you love to see. I'm telling you, like, the two CDM thing is is helping us so much. Like the formation is just so good. I don't know if that's I don't know. It's just it's so good. Okay, you know, Messi's got that somehow. We love to see it. I was trying to get him to do. The... Wait. Oh, Messi! <laughs> oh my God, that is incredible. I want to see if I can see a replay of that. That's insane. Oh, he didn't even show the turn. He did like um, he did like a Cruyff turn. That was insanity. Yo, let's go. That's a pen. There we go. Ah, <laughs> oh, Jesus. Just poor this game. There we go. Good pen. Let's go. Let's go back into the lead. Not that we have much of a lead anymore, to be honest, because I completely shat the bed and bending. It's just it always goes. It always goes that way. Brasco. I see Messi at the back. Come on, it's got to be Messi. Oh. Yo, Maradona. Hey, what? Why? A good guy. It's just so easy, man. It's just so easy. You just let him through. 90th minute. And you... I get taken out of the game by just, like, simple little stuff. We're playing so well as well. And we, we got, like, a 4-1 lead and then just completely shat the bed. Crazy. Crazy. I did predict it, to be honest. I did predict it. But it was a good game, in fairness. It was a good game. Uh, I can't I can't argue too much. We scored some nice goals. So that, that Cruyff turn or whatever it, whatever it was. Uh, real, real nice. So... Uh, I'm I'm quite happy with that, but unfortunately, 
we did only pick up a draw. It's not ideal in the way of points, to be honest. Um, but it is what it is. And here we go. So second opponent today. Got a very nice looking team. Very nice looking team. Obviously not too worried about um about the chemistry. Got a big verge at the back. It's got Mbappe, Coman, Rodrigo, I believe that is, the record breaker. Very nice looking team, to be fair. Can't argue with it. Can't argue with it at all. I do respect someone who isn't uh, too desperately focused on uh, getting 100, 100 chemistry on all of their players, but big ups. Maradona. Look at that pass. Let's go. What a finish. We see that pass by Messi. The Maradona is the actual pass I intended as well. That's insane. That was an insane pass. And a, a really good finish, in fairness. Really good finish. <laughs> oh my god. Lupari missed it. It was like, nah, I'm coming, I'm coming back for that ball. And he, he came back for the ball, to be fair. Can't really get to him. Oh, damn. It was a good pass in Venice. It was a good pass. I just couldn't. I just couldn't deal with it. Again. Yo, Robin, let's go. Instant reply. I and Robin. You don't often see him scoring in this series. Let's go. I think that was his, uh, getting on his strong foot, but it must have been because he would have missed otherwise. Yo, Bruno Perez down on the side. Can he get a good ball in to Jan Felix? Let's go. What a goal. Let's go. I didn't even know who that was going to, so I, uh, that's why I completely stopped, but let's go. Okay, I just boot it away. Let's boot it away. Let's go. We pick up the victory. Uh, it wasn't easy. It was not easy, especially getting near the end. That was a bit. Uh, that was a bit. Uh, that was a bit tight. But look at that. So whew, does not get much better than that. Why well, you got Messi in the team? That clinical passing, just, just insane. Maradona getting a nine point six as well. Two goals. One for Robin. One for Jaume. You love to see it. You love to see it. I'm pretty sure somebody else scored. Graven Birch was it? Might be, I don't know, can't remember. But uh, yeah, not an easy game. To be fair, that guy was pretty good. Um, you know, as you can see by the stats, it was very even. Very even, 10-10, 7-4, four goals, three goals. He had a bit more possession than me and it is what it is. But um, yeah, it was um, it was a close game, especially near the end. He put on a lot of pressure to try and win the ball back and it almost, almost paid off for him. We just had a para in the, a para in the right place at the right time. So kind of nullified the attack but um yeah it was a good game good game very very sweaty all right so last opponent today got uh thomas party informed scott mctominy got mane lucas Werner, martial interesting backline as well with uh, marquinhos Tellez, and tiago silva you don't often see that kind of brazilian link up but uh it's good to see someone using a you know a bit of a different team to uh joe gomez and carl walker all the time Good save by Edison. Very good save. Very good save. Just needed a little bit more power on it. And maybe that would have uh, sneaked into the back of the net. Yo, Maradona from there. That's looking good, to be fair. Uh, not quite. Not quite enough on it. Messi. Oh, my God. Having no, lucks, no luck with those, um, those finesse shots at the moment. Just, I don't know. Oh, Maradona gotta be. Let's go. Maradona with an insane finish. You see him backing off from the defence, waiting for that pass to Messi, and then you just finesse it in. Banging little goal off the post as well. You do love to see it. You do love to see it. Oh, Kappa. Kappa, let's go. Another one you don't often see in the score sheet. Good pass by Maradona. Then Kappa just puts it in the back of the net. Let's go. EDM, Robin getting all the goals today. <laughs> Any from there? Oh, unlucky. Unlucky. He tried the finesse shot around the keeper and apparently that uh, came off me. Oh, 
Oh my god, are you serious? Are you serious? That's the only place he could have put it. Oh my god. I just... Okay. Cool. No idea what's going on there, to be honest. No idea. All in. Shoot. Maradona! Oh. So close, man. So close, yet so far. I don't, I don't care. I don't care. The only change we're making is Eddie Nketiah, Arsenal legend, 71 rated. He's coming on to change the game. Get us a late late minute winner. That's all we need. And well, I mean, we, we gave it a good try, to be fair. Um, I just I just couldn't deal with the pace. As I don't know. I've just been struggling recently to defend against pacey players that just one through ball and they just run past. I just, I just don't know how to deal with it. I just don't know how to deal with it. Um... I don't know, maybe it's something to do with the, the custom tactics, you know, like, not essentially going drop back, but I don't play drop back, I play uh, balanced, so maybe maybe that's the reason, but I don't know, maybe it's something to do with the width or something like that, I don't know, but either way, that's how that's how that game ended, it's not, it wasn't terrible, I felt, the thing is, yesterday I was getting really frustrated because I was playing well when nothing was really kind of happening, um, like I just felt like I was so hindered by the players I was using and the formation and everything, and you know, partly the game, but not really. More just about like what's going on with me. Um, but today, I felt like I played really, really well, and the formation was so good. Um, but I can't, I can't really complain. To be fair, we scored some really nice goals. Uh, played some really nice FIFA. We didn't get all, all the, all the wins, but uh, we got a win. And I think the rest, well, there was a draw, and obviously the last one was a loss, but um. The team played really well. I, I can't argue with it at all. So I'm uh, I'm actually quite happy to be fair. Quite happy with the with the results. Um obviously if you have, if you didn't see the team that is that is what we're using. Um I've got to say though, on my uh, very minimal experience with Gravenberch so far, he is very, very good. May not be the most ideal CDM, um but I, I don't know, when you compare it to somebody like, you know, the 90 Roy Keane, who obviously hasn't got as much shooting or pace. Obviously, he's going to be better defensively and, and physically, but really, does that matter all that much? I mean, like, as long as he can take the ball and, you know, take, like, he beat Pogba most of the time, and Pogba's, you know, insanely more physical and, you know, all that kind of stuff of a player than this guy is. So, um, he, he had him in his pocket for most of the game. I don't know. He scored a goal, so I can't, I can't really fault him too much. Three games, one goal from CDM. That's uh, pretty decent. The last thing I wanted to mention that I forgot to earlier that Kleber has had his plus one upgrade to 85 to 86. Obviously, every every area area of the card has been a plus one upgraded. Um, so yeah, not that it makes too much difference. It does look quite nice though, and especially with that green kind of outer glow, very very nice stuff. But there we are. So that's where we're going to call this episode today. Um, hopefully, you have enjoyed. If you have, please do drop it a like. That'd be very, very much appreciated. Of course, that will help the channel out massively. And of course, if you did enjoy it, that will show me that you did enjoy the video. But um, <laughs> if you haven't already, please do consider hitting that subscribe button as well if you want to see more of this content uh, and become part of the exclusive family. But with that said, I do hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching and we'll see you next time.